Hi guys, my name is Jazz and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, I discuss everything fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. And I've been wanting to put this video together for a while. And it is a spring summer shoe guide um, of all the shoes and sandals that you need for spring slash summer. Um, we're in, still in spring, but summer is right around the corner. So I figured I would share um, kind of what you should have in your wardrobe, kind of what's in my wardrobe already, and any holes that I kind of want to fill. But um, yeah, so let's just get started. Um, first, I'll just start by saying um, that I love sandals and shoes. <laughs> um, and by the time I started this video, I was like thinking to myself like, man, I really don't have any flats, <laughs> any flat sandals or anything like that. So let's just get started with like just talking about statement sandals or statement shoes that you need for spring and the summer. Um, so you guys know I have a love for platforms, um, platform shoes. I think that's one of the trends. It's probably one of my favorites for this season and I like have things that I'm like into. Some are comfortable, some are not comfortable, but let's just start by the uncomfortable. So I got these from Ego. Now as you can see, this doesn't look comfortable at all, but I picked these up. Of course, these are like Valentino like dupes because I just feel like I would not spend that kind of money on something this trendy that I might wear a few times and kind of be done with it. But they're perfect um, for the season. They do what needs to be done. Like it's literally the same exact shoe. Um, Steve Madden has this in a few different shades, like the bone, black, um, and a few different colors. So if you really want to try the trend and didn't want to invest too much, I would definitely say to try these from Ego out. Um, I believe they're Ego's a UK based brand, but I got a size nine. And usually I'm like a true nine and a half. So the nine is a little, you know, pinches a little here, so it's probably not my most comfortable platform shoe that I own, but it still does what needs to be done. And like, how can you not? Like, look at this. If you're thinking about it, just try them out. Love them. Um, I want to call this part of the video like the statement sandals that you need for the spring because sometimes you just have to, you know, just make a statement and that's that. You know, the shoe has to do the work and this does that. So I love these um, from Ego. And again, they come in different colors. So if you want to try, I think they even come in the bubblegum pink. Literally, good dupes. Really, really good dupes, especially if you want to try out the trend. Um, next, if we're going to keep talking about platforms, you guys know I love these from Souk and Sepia. Now, these are fantastic. These are comfortable and everything. Like, they're so high. And I, I'm 5'7", so when I wear these, I'm like a little, like, you know what I'm I'm like six feet, and I don't care. But these are comfortable. Like, you could actually wear them and walk around and feel really good because it has that elevated, you know, platform here and like the heel and they come in different colors. They come in brown, um, gold. Um, I got the black ones cause they do what I need them to do in my wardrobe. But the comfort on these are amazing, like super amazing. And I love them and I'm obsessed with them. Next, you guys know, I have to talk about these platform loafers that I probably keep mentioning in every video from Nine West. Um, these are fantastic. So these are probably like my favorite platform shoes of the season because I, you know, I live for raffia. So the raffia just goes with everything in my wardrobe. I feel like if you're in doubt and you're somebody like sometimes I have a hard time like choosing a color. If something comes in like a like an array of colors, I'll be like, um, I don't know what color. Get a raffia, just a plain raffia because it'll be the perfect neutral, especially in the summer when you're going on vacation. They'll go with any dress any color. I believe these come in like an orange raffia, which is really pretty too from the website. But I just went for this and it just goes with everything. I said in one of my last videos, I went to Puerto Rico. If you haven't checked that vlog, I'll put it up here in the description. But I went to Puerto Rico, Old St. Juan, cobblestones, and I was walking around in these. And honestly, I was fine. Like, I was fine. Of course, I had to be careful, but I was fine. I was comfortable. I was able to walk. And I will say, even the amount of time that I spent walking, like over an hour, my feet didn't hurt. So that is the key. My feet didn't hurt at all. <laughs> so next in the statement shoes that I have, um, you guys know I have these platforms um, from Madden Girl, like Steve Madden, and then they're white. Um, but I feel like the white, if you don't have a white shoe in your wardrobe for spring, summer, like whether it's a pump, like a platform, a slide, I probably, I need actually a white slide get one because when you're color blocking, white goes with everything. They're almost like a raffia, like get a raffia shoe or a white shoe and it will go with anything you have, like literally. Like I'll put like orange pants on, put this in and ties it in together. I love white shoes. It's probably like 
my favorite thing to wear because it just makes a statement and it just brings everything together without trying so hard. So, you know, like when you're wearing a bunch of colors, you don't want to worry about what's on your feet, whites. These are comfortable as well. Um, these are fairly inexpensive. I got these from, I think I got these from Macy's. I got these from Macy's, I think. And these come in the black as well. Um, they're not as high as the ones from Ego, so I feel like these are a little bit more wearable. Like, I can wear these in a day in the city and walk around and be okay. Um, the Ego ones are really, they are really something else. <laughs> but these are really, really good, and I love them, and they're comfortable. I think that's all the platforms that I have um, for the season. Um, but that's like, if you can't tell, that's like my favorite trend, I think. I think so more so because as much as we love stilettos, sometimes they're not really like wearable when you actually want to go out and walk a little bit. I know myself very rarely do I go to a place and just get in the car and go out. You know, I gotta walk a few steps. I, like I live in New York, so even if it's walking to my garage, I have to walk. But um, the next kind of strappy shoe that I picked up and it's it's perfect is this one from Nine West. Clearly I love Nine West. They are a great brand. Um, they've been having a lot of great sandals at affordable price points, which is amazing because, you know, can't break the bank. But these feather shoes that I got from them, how great. Like, look at these. Now, the comfort on these are not, like, honestly, can I run in these and walk hours in them? Like, I could walk a little bit and be comfortable, but of course, they're not meant for me to wear all day, but that's okay because the price point and how they look, um, they come in other colors. They come in like a yellow and like a green. So if you're looking for that pop of color and you really love the glam feather this season, I would definitely say to check them out. But like I'm obsessed with these. Like these are probably like my new favorite shoe. I can't wait to wear them. Like look at these. So cute. So I love these so much. Like I feel like everything shoe, I'm like nine west, nine west. Because they've really been doing a really good job. Like at everything this season. So I love these. These are definitely glam, but this is, these are perfect. If you're somebody who, I like to say my style is like minimalistic sometimes, and like maybe I'll wear this top that I have on today and a pair of black pants. If you're going out for dinner and you don't want to do the most, imagine if I have the outfit I have on now, like this white top, padded shoulders top, black pants, and I just do these on with like a little clutch, done. You don't have to do anything. So I love these for that, and definitely check them out. Again, the comfort level is a little, you know, it's, it's iffy, but it's fine. It can make do. Um, next for like kind of like my sandal strappiness. Um, I feel like we're still in the statement category, if you per se. <laughs> um, you guys know Nine West again for the win. You know I love these denim slides. When I wore them, I got so many compliments. I will link them down below if they're still available. They might not be because they sold out like really fast. I don't think I had that much power, but when I wore them and I shared the link, people were buying them, so. Denim, all the rave this season. Um, I will link also to, not even just these, a few of my other favorite denim sandals. Like I think I saw one, um, like I saw there's these from Dolce & Gabbana that I'm obsessed with. They are everything, so good. And I actually was looking at those before I saw these. But I just felt like these were a little bit more wearable for me. And of course, the price point is a humongous difference, of course. But I felt like this was something that I will wear more than the other ones. But those are great denim slide. I think either Mark Fisher or I can't think of the brand right now has a really great option for denim if you're looking for something that's denim um, in a sandal and you're not sure what to get. But these, comfort, amazing. Just look at the detail. The detail's amazing. The heel is perfect. It's comfortable. Like, it's everything. So, so, so good. The next shoe in the statement category is these I got from Ego. And Ego, um, this was my first time ordering from them. And I got the orange, um, you know, Valentino dupes from them as well. Um, but this is my first time ordering from them. And I will say I was really impressed. Um, great price points, like, you know, fairly inexpensive. Perfect if you want to try out things and you just need shoes. Like, you know, you just you need to fill holes in your shoe wardrobe and you're not sure what to get. But these are great too. Um, they have, I'm not sure what the material is called, but it's almost like a, it feels a little silky. But these tie up. Um, they don't go all the way, but the heel is like great. Um, and this, it straps here, but it goes around the, the ankle, the leg, or whatever you want to call it. 
but these are the comfort was fairly good I learned this trick on TikTok. Um, a lot of times when I wear shoes like this it's not even so much that they hurt my feet the ball of my feet like burns so she said to put like a gel insert here which I usually do but I put a gel insert underneath your shoe and the comfort would be like out of this world that was a great trick and I can't wait to try that but these are great I believe these come in other colors as well and I really really like them so next I'm going to talk about some sandals and shoes um, for spring summer that a little bit more I guess more so on the practicality side <laughs> something that is more so you really need in your wardrobe um so first I'm going to talk about a just a plain basic nude mule kind of shoe um this is a take on the Bottega slide in mule but these are perfect the color goes with everything I'm um, literally I can wear this with anything that I own and it goes so well like 100% like perfectly I can wear it and it just is the perfect tie-in and I love it if you're somebody who pretty much works in an office setting and you can't really do like so much like strappy shoes or anything like that and you want something that you can like walk and be comfortable but still have your outfits tying together then this is the perfect shoe for that um these are from H&M last year I will link them if they're still available but of course they still have the square toe and I love them I don't think I thought I was going to wear them as much as I did but I wore them a lot like these are great um, I also have this um, this is kind of like your take on like the perfect strappy kind of like strap here strap around the ankle shoe for mango and this is like a snake and when I bought these I really didn't think that I was going to wear these as much as I do and I literally this snake type in like this material I guess or print it's like a, a neutral that just goes with things I didn't even know it would go with, <laughs> which I love. Again, even my black and white outfit, if I want to slip these on, I could and it goes. Um, the comfort on these are not the greatest because, of course, with this strap here, it always hits like that pinky toe right here and just makes it to be like a pain. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, beauty for pain, but it's a great heel option and perfect for you. Again, like I was saying before... Um, these from Nine West, these are pretty old, but any white pump, like I can't tell you the wear that I've got out of these shoes. Like the wear that I have gotten out of these shoes have been like something that I don't know if I like, I probably should get another pair because I've worn these that much. Perfect for the spring summer. They go with everything. Um, the comfort on these are is amazing. Um, the Balenciaga knife pumps are amazing. Like I actually want these pumps. And I haven't seen them in my size because I got so much wear out of these that I'm like, oh, these are definitely something that I should have in my wardrobe. But I haven't found them. I feel like they're sold out everywhere. If they're still available, of course, I will link them down below. And next, I have a whole review on these on my channel. If you haven't checked it out, I will link it. Um, but these Gucci platform slides, it's probably my take on more so, like more so a flat sandal. You won't see me post a few flat sandals that I have here because I really don't have many because either I'm in something like this or like a sneaker um, but these I've gotten my cost per wear I love these like the denim is like the perfect neutral I slide them on they make a statement they're an easy sandal I can walk around in them and they're great um, but I don't feel like I'm just wearing like a like a lazy flat I hate to say lazy but that's how it is sometimes um, but these are great. Um, I feel like a lot of companies have duped them. So even if you don't want like a monogram Gucci print, there are so many other different brands um, that have like those kind of uh, flats that I will link down below. But these are great. Um, so I also want to talk about kind of just like the take on a like a flat or like a sneaker. So um, I'm looking for sneakers now. But like my one sneaker option that I love is like a flat Converse, like a low top white Converse. Converse has many different options for footwear. No matter the type, they have like a high top, a low top, and I feel like they're really cute. And they're not awesome for the summer. Um, I love these new um, New Balance 5740 sneakers that are great. I want the neutral pair, but those are sold out everywhere. You guys know I love Nike blazers, so if you're somebody who's like a sneaker person and not really like a shoe person, take a look at those sneaker options as they are great as well. And then um, for flat sandals, um, these are the ones that I kind of have my eye on and I think are great for your wardrobe. Um, these Sam Edelman ones that are gold and they tie up. Those are beautiful, luxurious. Um, they don't look, I hate to say basic, but sometimes like I just feel like when you just get a little plain old flip flop, it just doesn't do anything for your outfit. You know, it just kind of looks, I hate to say it, lazy, you know. 
So having some type of print or some type of metallic makes your outfits pop and look good together. I also love these from Mark Fisher. I know the Balenciaga had a flat sandal like this, but the puff is super cute and super fun. And I love those. And those are all the shoes I think you should have in your spring summer wardrobe. Let me know what shoes you have your eyes on this spring summer. I feel like I'm done. I feel like I don't have any holes anywhere except for like some sneaker flat options that you know I'm gonna get because I have a few vacations coming up so I'm gonna slide in and get some things like that but everything else I'm, I'm pretty covered so let me know which shoes were your favorite um let me know what shoes you plan on getting this spring summer like something do I need to know something like is there something that I need to get now let me know in the comments be sure to like this video and subscribe and until next time guys be safe and be well bye